We have officially wrapped up week one of the NFL season. 38 to 20, and Jordan Love couldn't start it any better. Before we get into week two's picks, how about some housekeeping from week one? Our experts finished at the bottom of the trio going 7-9, and nine, while the Madden simulation hit 500 going 8-8. Eight and eight. And in first place after her week one of picks, we have the world, which finished 9-7. and seven. Luckily for the house, we did save face by hitting our lock of the week, but the fans still beat us and the Madden Sim, so that means there will be two lucky winners. Jamal Jackson 7736, who said Bryce Young would have two picks, and Trey Gilmore 2016, whose crystal ball keyed in on Sam Howell throwing for 200 yards and one INT. So hey, big congrats to our big winners. But now, we're on to week two, where there will still be an opportunity to earn some TPS bucks. So to make sure you're in the mix after you vote, number one, make sure you're subscribed to our channel. Number two, like this video. And number three, comment below with your bold prediction for week two. Woo! All right, let us get into the games. Minnesota Vikings at Philadelphia Eagles. For this week's edition of Thursday Night Football, the Minnesota Vikings are looking to bounce back after their shocking Week 1 loss to the Tampa Bay Bucks on the road against the defending NFC champion Philadelphia Eagles. The TPS, however, aren't sold on Kirk Cousins and co riding the ship against such a solid Eagles side. But when we plugged it into the computer, well, there was a rather shocking outcome. You see, Madden had the Vikings rolling the birds 31-13. to Our experts are taking the chalk in this one. Neither team really looked particularly good in Week 1, but you know, the Eagles have way more talent across the board and are going to be on their home turf, and they should take this game with relative ease. Final score, Eagles 28, Vikings 17. Chicago Bears and Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Tampa Bay was the big surprise across the league in Week 1, as the Bucks upended the Vikings behind a solid defensive performance and some gutsy play down the stretch from Baker Mayfield. He's going to run it himself, trying to steal on Murphy and gets a couple of extra yards. Wait up, little boy! Well, the polls show that the world likes the Bucks to take this one at home, as does the Madden Sim, which predicted a final score of 38 to 24. The TPS team, however, sees a different outcome playing out. Chicago is going to open the playbook back up for Justin Fields and put their dual threat quarterback in a position to do what he does best and make plays with his legs. The Bears are going to dominate the time of possession battle and win a relatively low scoring affair, 20 to 18. Green Bay Packers at Atlanta Falcons. Jordan Love and the Green Bay Packers are riding high after their Week 1 NFC North grudge match against the Bears. Week 2 will be a new challenge as they head to Hot Atlanta to face off with the Falcons team that had a nice division win of their own against the Carolina Panthers last week. The voters have sided with Green Bay, thinking that Love will seamlessly continue the Packers' tradition of excellent quarterback play. Madden actually predicted a close one. Atlanta kicked a field goal down the stretch to force overtime. Green Bay, however, lucked out on the coin toss and got to start with the ball, but they can only manage field goal. Unfortunately for the Falcons, their offense sputtered, sealing a 34-31 victory for the Packers. And you know, our experts also like Green Bay in a close one. Atlanta's run-heavy offense will be effective again, but they won't have enough firepower to outlast Love, Watson, and Aaron Jones. Green Bay will score just enough and win this one 24-21. Indianapolis Colts at Houston Texans. The Indianapolis Colts will have a good opportunity to get in the W column as they travel to Houston to face a Texans team that got stumped by the Ravens in week one. The community voters are believers in the Colts' explosive rookie quarterback Anthony Richardson and like Indy's chances on the road. The cruel cold logic of technology, however, was not quite as kind to Jim Irsay's bunch, picking the Texans to win by a final score of 35 to 14. Our experts, however, have a different take. We see the Colts playing another steady game and edging out the Texans 17 to 13. The Seattle Seahawks at Detroit Lions. Week one got off to a promising start for Geno Smith and the Seahawks. Seattle looked great in the first half against the LA Rams until it all came apart in the second half. They have a tough matchup with Detroit, who's riding high after upsetting the Chiefs at an arrowhead during the nationally televised season opener. The TPSers believe that Jared Goff and his crew are for real, and they are buying high on the Lions. The Madden Sim, perhaps even more so, as it played out a 31 to nothing shutout victory. And look, as much as I hate to break it to our fans in the Pacific Northwest, yeah, we got to back Detroit too. The offense looks legit, and the Lions have just enough on defense to hold off Geno and the Seahawks offense. Nope. Final score, Lions 31, Seahawks 28. 
Los Angeles Chargers, and Tennessee Titans. The Los Angeles Chargers were bested in a close one by the Dolphins in what was easily the most exciting game to watch during the Week 1 slate, or handed to the Music City to square off with the Titans team that lost one of the most boring games we saw Week 1 against the Saints. Yeah, no shocker here, but we have a consensus pick. The community voters are siding with the Chargers, and the Madden Sim predicted a thorough 30-17 victory for Los Angeles, which... Uh, you know, isn't too far off from what we envision happening. Justin Herbert and the Chargers cruise to a 27-21 victory that isn't even as close as that score might suggest. Baltimore Ravens at Cincinnati Bengals. The Baltimore Ravens thumped the lowly Texans to start the season, but will have a much taller task this week when they ship out to Cincinnati to face a talented Bengals team looking to rebound from an embarrassing L to the Browns. The TPSers aren't worried about the Bengals' water finding its level, and they're taking the Ravens. Madden, on the other hand, likes Cincy to win this one relatively comfortably. The final score, 28-21, but it really isn't even that close as it is inflated by a garbage time touchdown from Lamar Jackson to Mark Andrews, who, let's face it, we never know until game time will even suit up. Our experts are siding with the machines in this one, since he wins a high-scoring affair, 33-28. Las Vegas Raiders at Buffalo Bills Jimmy G and the Las Vegas Raiders sent a ripple of shock through the NFL world in Week 1 with how, well, competent they looked against a stout Broncos defense. They'll be looking to continue their winning ways against a Bills team that's coming off an extremely deflating Monday Night Football loss to an Aaron Rodgers-less Jets team. The TPSers see this as a get-right spot for Buffalo and are back in the Bills, as is Madden, which predicted a 31-21 victory that will delight the fans in Western New York. And that's not too far off from what our experts project, that being a Bills 30-13 victory over Vegas. Kansas City Chiefs at Jacksonville Jaguars Well, it doesn't get much more disappointing than a nationally televised loss at home on banner night, but that is exactly what the Chiefs are coming off as they head down to Duval to face an upstart Jags team that earned a hard-fought W against the Colts in Week 1. The community voters like KC to bounce back, and with good reason. After all, this is Patrick Mahomes and the reigning champs we're talking about. It's hard to picture them starting the season 0-2. Though, that's exactly what Madden sees happening, as the Sims showed a 28-20 Jaguars victory. Our team, however, thinks it'll be a highly contested affair. But with that, Kadarius Tony gets demoted to a diminished role, perhaps even a healthy scratch, and Mahomes will be able to get enough out of his skeleton crew of wide receivers to win this one, 27-26. San Francisco 49ers at Los Angeles Rams. A drum roll, please, as we have our lock of the week. The San Francisco 49ers are headed south to Los Angeles to face the Rams. The TPSers think that they pick up where they left off last week when they were throttling the Steelers and beat the Rams on their home field. Madden, however, sees another crazy Rams game playing out. After a Los Angeles field goal since the game to overtime tied 28 all, the Rams hold the Niners to a field goal on their overtime possession and win the game on a Stafford touchdown pass to Cam Akers. Yeah, our team isn't trusting the computer though. Final prediction, Niners 28, Rams 10. New York Giants at Arizona Cardinals. The Giants were humiliated at home by the Cowboys on Sunday Night Football and now have to head west to the desert to face the Cardinals. The TPS community thinks that New York gets right against the Cardinals team that many expect to be in contention for the first overall pick this year. As does Madden, which predicted a 27-21 New York victory, cemented by an end-of-game Josh Dobbs interception. And you know, yeah, we also like the Giants. It's hard to picture Coach Dable not using last week's embarrassment as a powerful motivational tool. So, look for New York to take it 27 to 13. New York Jets at Dallas Cowboys. The Jets and Cowboys are set to square off in Jerry World, with both teams coming off big primetime wins. The voters were actually pretty split on this one, with you all the world being 50-50 on this one up until the very end. Madden thinks that Jerry's squad will control the game and hold off a late push by the Jets to win 27-20. Our experts, however, think that this Jets team is too complete to fold quite yet, and will manage a 24-23 victory. Washington Commanders at Denver Broncos The Commanders did just enough to win at home week one against the lowly Cardinals and are now headed west to face a Broncos team that may still be reeling from squandering a great start from Russell Wilson and fell to the Raiders. TPSers aren't worried though. They think Sean Payton gets the Broncos back on the saddle at home. Unlike the Madden Sim, which predicts a 24-13 Commanders win. Well, the TPS experts also like Washington in this one, but think that Denver's defense shows up in full force yet again, holding Sam Howell and the boys to just 14 points. Points. Unfortunately for the Broncos, Wilson's offense can only manage 10. Final score, Washington 14, Broncos 10. 
Miami Dolphins at New England Patriots The Dolphins won a slobber knocker week one against the Chargers and are now headed to Foxborough to face a Patriots team that nearly knocked off the reigning NFC champs. The voters weren't sold on Belichick's crew though, and think that the Dolphins keep rolling. Madden, on the other hand, predicts a dramatic Patriots victory. With 51 seconds left on fourth down at the Patriots 42, Tua gets hit as he throws after the play action and it's incomplete. New England wins 24 to 21. Our experts think that it'll be an exciting one, but slightly higher scoring. And with Miami on top. End result, Dolphins 30, Pats 27. New Orleans Saints at Carolina Panthers. Derek Carr and the Saints did just enough to eke out a win against the Titans last week and are headed to Charlotte to face a Panthers team that fell to Atlanta. The TPSers are predicting that the Saints will take it, continuing their early season momentum. But the Madden Sim has other ideas and sees a Panthers 24-17 victory that is iced by a clutch third down conversion from Panthers running back Miles Sanders. The TPS pickers don't see that vision though. Carr can and will outduel the rookie Bryce Young to a 20-17 win. Cleveland Browns at Pittsburgh Steelers The Browns are coming off an empathetic win against the Bengals and have another big AFC North matchup on the road against the Pittsburgh Steelers. The voters like what they saw out of Cleveland Week 1 and are backing the Browns to do it yet again. As is the Madden Sim, which predicts an exciting 31-28 win that saw Kenny Pickett in the Steelers in field goal range and blow a chance to close the gap by tossing a pick in the end zone. Our experts are bucking the trend though and think that Tomlin finds a way to get his team back on track and the Steelers win this one 21-14. All right, and that does it. TPS vs. The World is underway. So, don't forget to subscribe and like the video, then add your own bold prediction down below for a chance to win some awesome prizes. And be sure to vote on next week's game in our community section. Then, tune in next week to see if you won.